Mr. Jackson and Chief Meteorologist David Eckerd. Well, here we are in the month of August, and now is the time when we really start beginning to focus in on the Atlantic hurricane season. In fact, the activity normally really ticks up here as we move into the back end of the month. So you can see, normally speaking, in the start of August, which is right here on your screen, not a ton of activity on our hurricane climatology chart, but notice how quickly this graph just really expands upward. In fact, as we move towards the back end of August, that's when we really begin to track multiple tropical waves. Oftentimes we're tracking multiple tropical depressions as well. And our climb continues all the way to the tippy top of the scale, which is on September the 10th, which is the statistical peak of hurricane season. So August is the month that we really begin to start turning our attention to the tropics on a more kind of consistent and daily basis. So is there anything out there right now the answer is not really. This has got one little area out here in the open Atlantic. Been watching it the last couple of days, but the window for development has basically closed. This is going to remain extra tropical and kind of zip its way up in the portions of the Atlantic. There are some tropical waves that are sitting uh, down towards the south here in the, what we call the main development region. However, this activity right now is just kind of in a hostile environment, probably not going to develop much over the next, say, five to even seven days. However, there are a couple pieces in place here for the action to really tick up as we move into maybe mid to late August. I want you to notice the water temperature anomaly. So this isn't water temperatures. This is highlighting areas that are warmer than average. And notice the entire area here. This is what we call the main development region or MDR. Almost every piece of water out there is currently sitting above average. And keep in mind the MDR this time of year is pretty warm water. So we're talking about some very, very warm conditions here in the MDR. We also have some warm water up into parts of the Canadian Maritimes and off the northeast coast as well. And we also have some warm water, as we've been reporting on, in the Gulf of Mexico. So bottom line here, the conditions could be somewhat favorable for activity to tick up, especially for the back end of the month. Not seeing an eminent signal of that, but bottom line, now is the time to really start thinking about hurricane season. And if you haven't done so already, now is the time to start preparing with your hurricane prep kit. I'm Assistant Chief Meteorologist David Eckert for Channel 4, The Local Station.